Hey everyone, welcome back to Low Luxury, the channel where I show you what authentic luxury clothing and streetwear looks like. And today, I'm going to be showing you a Helmet Lang t-shirt. So let's get into it. So first, let's take a look at the bag that it comes in. It's a clear plastic bag, and there's one sticker that is your barcode. And then you've got your model right there with a model number at the bottom, and then your size right there. And you've got another sticker with your style, number, color, size, and a barcode. And that number is going to match what's on the other sticker up there. And on the back of the bag, you've got your typical, this bag is not a toy warning. Now let's take a look at the retail tags. So you've got a thick white piece of cardboard there. You can see how thick it is. And on there you've got an embossed black Helmet Lang logo. You can feel each letter there. Take a look at that typeface, that spacing between each letter and how centered it is on the card. And on the back you've got a sticker at the top of it. You've got Helmet Lang, the name, color, fabrication, style, and size. And that's perforated down at the bottom with your price down there. And that is attached with a thin white string with a sort of white plastic cylinder there. And then that gets connected to the top with a simple safety pin. Now let's take a look at the brand tags at the back of the neck. So this is a simple white kind of muslin feeling label here. You've got that logo centered right in the middle there in black. And that is stitched in in the top corners with a green stitch, same color as the shirt itself. When you fold that over, you can start to see the logo coming through because, as I said, it is a kind of thin cloth tag. And then you get another tag, that same cloth material, but this one's coming down vertically. And right there, you've got that logo made in Portugal, and then made in Portugal but in French. And then you've got a good amount of white space here. Let's so take a look at how long that comes down and the spacing of each of those things. And then right next to that, you've got your size tag, and that is stitched in to the neck itself. Now let's take a look at the fabric tags. You can see it is stitched in, in green. You can see that in the back and front. And these are that same cloth material. And this one is very thick, but it is a loop tag. So it's stitched in the top and bottom so it doesn't loop into the hem but you can see how it's kind of cut right there that's interesting i haven't seen that before so on this tag you've got washing instructions and you've got a model number there and then you've got the only company that cares for you look at that capitalization there that's interesting and then on this side you've got it's the same tag but just in french and then the last thing i'll point out is that just take a look at this print here and look at how clean it is. There are no rough edges there around any of these straight lines or around any of the curves. It's really, really clean print. And if you got one and these are all rough and jagged around the edges, especially if it's supposed to be new, definitely something to be concerned about. So that is how you tell the difference between a real and a fake Helmet Lang t-shirt. Take a look at one of these videos that's up on screen, subscribe if you like it, and I will see you next time.